the object everyone's been after, the very thing that caused so much pain and bloodshed, is now in my hands. Seeing Farther told me it's secret, and now I too carry the burden. It hangs from my neck like a millstone, and Ray gazes at it as lustfully as he does Marissa. Maybe it is better I hold it, otherwise my brothers would kill each other to possess it. I pray to the Almighty for our safe passage from this dangerous place. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil, for thou art with me. What did he mean by we're both here for the woman? I asked you a question. Don't push me, Ray. That girl's mine. Yeah? Well, what if she don't want you? She told me she did. Because she was hoping you'd kill Juarez. She say anything to be rid of him. You have a way with women, Thomas. No doubt about it. But not this time. This time, I'm the one who gets the girl. Who you think told me about Juarez's scheme? About them guns? Jesus Christ, open your eyes, Ray. You can't see the forest for the trees. How long has this been going on? Since the beginning. Why are you doing this to me, brother? It ain't about you, Ray. It's about me, and it's about Marissa. What the hell? What's going on? Who the hell's that? Barnsby!
Ray! You're alive? Move, goddammit! Let's get the hell out of here! Come on! Move before they cut us down! They're loading their field pieces! Up the hill! Let's go! Move, you stupid son of a bitch! They'll rip us to pieces! Ray! You're alive? Move, goddammit! Let's get the hell out of here! Come on! Move before they cut us down! They're loading their field pieces! Up the hill! Let's go! Move, you stupid son of a bitch! They'll rip us to pieces! now.
Now, I don't have time to fight about this. They're gonna shoot us like sitting ducks here. They'll patch you too, unless we take out those cannons. Now, I don't have that much TNT, but I got enough to push some rocks down on them. Well, you and me, brother, just like old times. I'm only doing this for them. Let's go. Keep close! I'll blow that rock loose. That should do it. Just cover me. Don't worry. Clay, you there? Did you decide to take a nap? Say adios, amigo. Ten seconds. Run away. Get your ass out of there. What are they waiting for? Chief, my name is Bonsby, Colonel in the Second Corps of the Army of Northern Virginia. I'm here for that medallion, and I will offer you a fair exchange. Hand it over right now, and I will give you back something that you hold dearly. Son of a bitch. He's got your son. I am already dead, father. Do not talk to them. You hand over that medallion or he will die. Right here, right now. Seen father is Apache. He will face death bravely. Look around you. Your village is gone. Your people are dead. Are you willing to sacrifice your last male heir? You ready to let your line, your tribe, your people die out? Let him go! Hausa! Let him go, and Running River will get you the medallion. No, Chief! I want it in my hand! Then I let him go. Understand? Running River understands. Good. I'll be waiting in the ghost settlement. You surely know where that is. You have until sundown tomorrow. Or your son die. That medallion ain't where you think it is, Chief. What do you know of it? Where else would it be? Who would dare take it? Your son? <laughs> 